Ready to fight? Ready. Yeah. All right, so what has become seemingly an annual stop for the MMA leader, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. We are back inside Gionese Arena here tonight, and you can expect these Brazilians to be early, to be loud, and to get behind their fighters as usual. Every time, I mean, they're loud. They're behind their guys. They almost propel the Brazilian fighters to some of their greatest accomplishments, some of their best performances to date. Oh, nice land with the knee. You see the taller fight. The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive upper left leg. All right, so he's landed a few big uppercuts already in DC. I know you're in the prediction business. You think he's going to set it up again? I am certain he's going to try and set that up again. Expect it to come off of the left hook because off the left hook, you don't anticipate the next punch coming right up the middle. He's real good at trying to find that shot. Well, every MMA fight begins on the feet, and that is music to the ears of Alex Pereira, who has found a home for that left hook early. I mean, that's his best shot, man. We have seen Alex Pereira land this left hook in kickboxing to finish Israel Adesanya, and also inside the octagon where he knocked out Sean Strickland. It is such a powerful strike. Oh, huge connection there! He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a Well, maybe he'll look to set up that hook again. Well, DC kind of just playing with him at this point, right? You think he's got to go in. But will do it! Alex Pereira! What a result in Rio, a stutter! <laughs> oh, man. We now go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 53 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Alex Poetak Herrera! Wow, what else can you say about Alex Pereira? We have called most of the...